you know, it's trusting in Riley and trusting that, um, you know, he does his homework and it's something that, you know, you, you trust your catcher in that situation. You trust the guys behind you. And, um, you know, thankfully the ball bounced our way today. Um, and we were able to um, have that shut down in the second. Um, and then we were able to pitch out of it in the fifth. Um, but in, in those situations, you trust your catcher and you trust your, your preparation. And you trust that the guys are going to make the plays behind you because the guys behind the guys behind us, um, you know, they want the ball every every time. So you know, you give the what you can't def, what you can't defend is walks, and um, you know, especially with the bases loaded, no outs, you can't you have nowhere to put them. But um, you know, the guys behind me want to make that play and, and force force uh, the guys behind me to make the play. You've mentioned Riley a couple of times. What makes him you know? What makes the partnership between the two of you so effective? Uh, I mean, not just Riley, but um, Cabert as well. I mean, the, the, those both those guys have done tremendous jobs for um, not only our rotation but our entire staff, and um, they're putting in the work um, every day. You know, for, for starting pitchers, we get four days off to put in work, but those guys are doing work. Um, you know, before they get to the field, um, on the airplane, and those guys are really they're studying hard to uh, to give our team the best chance and give our rotation the best chance to uh, to uh, keep the game close and to, to give the team a chance to win. How would you describe your mindset? Yeah, it's always fun, uh, especially against these guys, um, you know, coming off the World Series year. And then just the atmosphere here is is fun. So uh, being able to win one nothing against this team is awesome. Watching Trevor do what he did tonight, what was your overall impression? It was fun. Um, the base had loaded jams and getting out of it twice with no outs was uh, exciting to watch. So uh, never a doubt is what we told him. So it was, it was fun, though. As someone who pitches in high leverage situations, what can you appreciate the most about what Trevor did in those situations? Uh, I was, we were talking about it in the bullpen. Um, I feel like every time I'm in that situation, um, we don't get out of it. So watching him do it, I'm like, it's crazy. It's, I mean, I, told, I asked him if he's uh, been hanging out with Finney at all because uh, Finney's got the horseshoe, but he pitched, you know, they, he pitched great tonight and got out of it. So it was, it was just it was awesome. What were the emotions for you getting out of the seventh inning jam? Um, and I feel like I ask you this all the time, but then recomposing yourself to come back for another inning. Um, I feel like I'm just kind of starting to get used to it now. So it's... Just another day at, at, at the field. Um, I'm getting a little better at staying loose in between innings, and um, it's uh, starting to feel a little bit better.